What are you doing, Levi? I gotta go get some bead maker. Well, why are we doing that? Well, Matt's never tried it. Dun, 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 dun. The um, detail mafia and me are like they're like the polar opposites of the, yeah, of yeah. the world. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, this is this is where we we uh, create nerd, unity. Nerd dad, that's you know, like I'm afraid of those guys. Like they scare me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have tattoos, so I'll protect you. So this this this, this hood's been uh, it's been stripped. We wet sanded on it. Had it's had paint though. prep on it. It's got everything. Yeah. So right now it doesn't have anything on it. We just used uh, um, O and R to clean it. Yeah. So basically, with with bead maker, you need to have. A good amount of coverage on it and then take a towel and you want to spray the towel too okay. and then wipe it and then flip your towel and dry it so once you've applied it so you do like a wet you feel like you're kind of like uh even, like other even coverage wet, right yeah. coating the whole surface yeah right? it's kind of like the other wet applied sealants in you're the sense it. like you're and you're it. telling me this will work with coatings so and we'll not and not get all get all crunchy. Yeah, yes. No, there's no SiO2 crunchy. in it. Yeah. But, but what about waxed? It'll do the same thing. It'll add uh, an extra layer of protection and creates an extremely high contact angle on the surface. So the other thing is it's got a cure time. Okay. So realistically, after this is the true application of it, in about eight hours it'll get even slipperier. But after you've yes. done this application, after it's cured, you can get it wet and use it as a quick detail spray. You'll notice it'll start to get slipperier and slipperier. And it'll feel like that. Currently, I can go about three weeks without washing my car and it'll still feel yeah, it's, slippery. It's, it's very strange. So what is it? We don't know. So it is it so it's a sealant. So it is a, it is a spray it's, sealant. It's a spray sealant. Polymer based sealant. It's a polymer based polymer. sealant. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And what it has is, we've been told it has a hardening agent by Dave, the uh, chemist at PNS. Mm -hmm. but it has a hardening agent in it, mm -hmm. so it actually actively will harden coatings even more. See, I was looking for. I've been looking shell. for something that works for wax and coating. Yeah. That's why I like this stuff, is because you can put it on top of anything. It creates its own surface tension after on whatever it's been put on. Yeah. It's, it's, a, basically it's, a, it's a stack of a product and, and it's one of those things that they made it to where the polymers do attach to. Like, like basically if you're, to like take, if you're to take a quick coating. detailer and put it on a coating, that coating yeah. will shed that quick detailer in days. But because of the way this was designed, it was meant to stack on all it, coating. It'll connect to the like-minded polymers that are in a ceramic coating. So it mitigates the clear similar to OptiSeal and creates that bond with the other surfaces or the other products of the paint. Hmm. No, and I it just gets slipperier and slipperier and slipperier. I slipper. mean, that feels pretty, I mean, for just what you did and just... Mm -hmm. Whoa. Hmm. Yeah. Like I said, it'll get slipperier. You guys have this? I can buy a bottle of it? Yeah. So let's do it as a drying aid. I'll put some Owen Arbor here. I supplement one, two sprays, two big sprays maybe. Yeah, because you did a lot over there. Yeah, this is how I would normally drying it. Yeah, so then just do it like you normally do. I spray the towel too, that way I've got a little product on it. Oh yeah, that's what I do too, good point. Oh, <laughs> good thing. <laughs> Alright, this could be it. There's no way the Detail Mafia is going to let me sell their crap. <laughs> you never know, it's not the Detail Mafia that you got to ask. This is Bob Phillips. What? He's a cool correct. cat. What do you think for like the application, the difference yeah. between the two? Yeah, this is good. You're right. It's good, right? See? Yeah, nope, the nobody, fact you got him to begrudgingly admit he yeah, kind of liked it is a victory. Nobody hates on oh. bead maker. Everybody loves yeah. bead maker. I've yet to hear one person that doesn't like it. Yeah, it's yeah. like, like, some professionals freak out a little bit because you use a lot of product when you apply it on a car. First, initially, yeah, first, first too, yeah, you apply a lot, yeah. With, but that's with any product that you're going to build a base you know, with it. But then you find out the cost of a gallon and it doesn't seem so bad after exactly. that. Exactly. It smells great. It smells awesome. Yeah. yeah. I mean, if nothing else, the smell sells just about anybody. Yeah, I like it. I'm gonna have to test it. Yeah. 
Yeah, there you go, guys. Let's see it in the sun. Yeah, I think uh, so far, it's a running approval so far. We'll, we'll see where it goes.